Well, if size, space, quality, views, and shedding are of high importance to you, you are tuned into the right channel. Facebook Live Open Home here with Claire Rock behind the camera. Hello, everyone. And I'm Daniel Sheehan. We're from O'Brien Real Estate Clark. And what we've got on offer here today is at 23 Lilico Road in Warrigal. We're on the north side of town. And Claire, just pan around to that uh, scenic panorama towards the Bore Bore Ranges. Yeah, it's pretty much 180 degree views, isn't it? It is. We've got a lovely uh, established one and one quarter acre allotment here. This home was built back in 2003, so it's 21 years old and uh, owner built. So uh, renowned local builder um, has done a fantastic job, really well built and it stood the test of time. It's got a great floor plan. It's great for families. It's a big four bedroom home. Size of the home, uh, we're a little under 33 squares of living area, a little over 38 under roof line. Um, and as I said, it's got excellent shedding up at the rear as well. We're standing atop the uh, spacious two car garage, and this is a great outdoor entertaining area. Huge sort of uh, patio area. Um, and this home is right for entertaining. Um, it, uh, I guess, sort of mingles the, uh, the, the, the family and meals area here along with this outdoor area. And what we've got here is a uh, bit of a, a, a spa room or rumpus room, if you like, um, which ties everything in. So we'll start at this end of the house. We'll work our way that way. And I'm not gonna get in there because that no. door's locked. <laughs> Let's start in here. So spacious open plan living area, family room tiled floor. Uh, you've got a good sized kitchen there. We'll get to that in a moment. Uh, the home has gas ducted heating. We are on natural gas down here. So we're on the outskirts of town. There's a little bit of residential development happening in the area as well. But it's important to know that to be on an acre of, you know, a, a property of this size, uh, this close into town, very convenient. Um, so let's get back to this room. So these doors obviously open up and this becomes part of the entertaining area. So we've got a uh, huge spa there and a third bathroom so shower room there with a um, sink and toilet that becomes the third bathroom in the property so a good little spot to sit whatever the weather open those doors out downstairs there uh, we've got access to a very small sort of uh, rumpus area or office area at the rear of the garage and then as i said a spacious two-car garage with automatic doors you can imagine sitting in that spa, Daniel, and enjoying that vast skyline that you get from this elevation. Certainly Aren't can, you? yeah. Yeah, it's hard to say on um, film, but it just, it would be very impressive. Yeah, that's a, a really nice spot out there. Concreted, so you can, you, know, you can put a fire pit out there. You've got some beautiful colour in all the established trees. We've got some lovely maples out on that north side as well. So it's a, a really nice spot to sit. We move on to the kitchen, laminate kitchen. There's plenty of bench space, there's plenty of cupboard space. We've got a two door pantry, Westinghouse appliances, electric oven and gas cooktop, uh, integrated Miele dishwasher as well. So all the fixtures are, are, are really well done. Obviously the home is 21 years old. It's not modern by today's standards, but it's in tip top condition. The home's recently had a, uh, a recent internal paint uh, and also new carpets put in throughout as well. So there's some upgrades been happening. We've got a nice north facing meals area here. And to your left, Claire, the laundry. Great storage in here and obviously external access. Yep, plenty of room, footpath out to the clothesline. Yeah, one thing the house has got is good storage. It also has ducted vacuum. So it's four bedrooms plus a study. So in here, we've got a fitted desk, overhead shelving, and fitted robe space as well. Okay, so this could actually be a fifth bedroom. Is could that be. what you're saying? Yep. Absolutely, yep. So we come through here, this is a more of a sort of formal lounge or sitting room. Again, all those living spaces, they're all orientated to that north side, so they do get a lot of natural sunlight coming in here, and, and again, those amazing views. So um, this is a good spot for the kids to sit and watch TV. And 
and then we come through here so we've got so we can shut this off to all the uh, the bedrooms secondary bedroom through there it's all new roller blinds on all the windows as well so put some money into it before it's gone on the market just to dress it up a little bit presents really well as I said it's a great floor plan for for large families again more storage up on the right there up the hallway so you've got four doors of linen press there another bedroom that one's got a nice little outlook to the garden there we'll go around there in a moment the main bathroom and separate toilet lovely functional space it is yeah good size three drawer vanity we come to the end here where we've got a bedroom on either side so uh, that's the third bedroom of all the, uh, the secondary rooms a bit of an office or a music room there but um, got fitted robes and you will no doubt see when you peek out of all of these windows how beautifully manicured those gardens are yes yeah it's the really owner well takes kept. a lot of a lot of pride in keeping that lawn nice and level and green and lush so uh, this is the main bedroom so uh, really good size nice and light great views again see the ski slopes of Mount Borbore when you wake up um, yeah really nice sort of fresh feel to it that internal paint job has been uh, has worked wonders spacious walk-in robe so good hanging built-in shelving And your ensuite, which is a uh, good size. Got a nice big shower. Even a view from the bathroom. That's exactly what I was, what I was about to say. Every, every window you look out of mm. just has a beautiful vista. Yep, it's lovely. All right, let's head outside. Out this door and we'll take a bit of a, a bit of a lap around the house and start to appreciate these amazing gardens and established trees a lot of color as I said Lovely flower on this one here there's a nice water feature there with a, a cascading waterfall that usually runs down there um, the driveway has also just been upgraded we've put some new crushed rock down here so Plenty of off-street parking. You've got a, a couple of parking bays here. A um, bit of a turning circle if you like. And then access down to the two-car garage. We'll just quickly uh, poke our heads around the corner there and have a look. And a bit of a view from the uh, view of the house from here as well. You can see all those big windows on that north side. And as you can see through there, we've got our um, two separate roller doors on that uh, expansive two-car garage. So it's extra wide and extra long. And as you can see there with the car, there's a bit of extra height in that uh, the door clearance there as well. So high clearance doors, lots of lovely lush grass everywhere and shading trees. There's your boundary on this side and you can see your post and wire boundary up the back there. And this driveway runs all the way up round to the shed. And when I say shed, I mean a shed. So this would suit uh, you know, all you tradespeople, um, you know, anyone with a large caravan, additional vehicles, trailers, a boat. Um, 12 by 18 metres in size. It's got power to the shed, plenty of storage area and there you can see there's a little bit of a lean-to on the side as well. Um, so lots of space and uh, yeah, very versatile for uh, whoever the buyer may be. So you've got a large house, large shed, fantastic views and a well-built home and a great location too. Lillico Road is a, a really popular part of town on this north side uh, particularly because of the views and uh, 
yeah, it's definitely well worth a look. So we urge you to give us a call and arrange your inspection today.